I feel that the city itself is like it developed quite fast in KL, so and a lot of different kind of funny things happen. In certain states, I suddenly I feel that yeah, I need to uh, to know more about my country, the city that I live. So I start the project for like past few years. Yeah, this is how the paintings come. I think I chose the images because it start from a case that uh, I think it's around four or five years ago. So it's a flyover the highway in Kuala Lumpur. It's like they just built the highway for around two years. Then he start to like crack everywhere. So it's, it's like, yeah, things that happen like that. So because I need to travel, I use the dead road every day to my studios. So, yeah, I feel that it's quite, what happened to the things like, so that all the stories start from there. But I'm thinking of like painting. Painting normally is like, we deal with a color, shape, line, images. So beside that, what I can use to, to as, a, as an element for paintings. So I uh, do my, yeah, develop the idea thing about that and, yeah, go, to, go, for, go back to the very basic, it's the materials. And the cutting, uh, for me, is a attitude. Yeah, it's, it, try to, it, it seems like it's trying to destroy something complete and it look for a new way to go. Yeah, I think it's that, that is the, the thing that it, for me is important even in, in my creativity. Korea and even for the context, the contents of the painting itself, we can't always like depends on what we see, what we heard. Yeah, it may just part of the story. So we need to look for the truth or the story behind the images.